morning, boy. Hungry? Let's get you some food. There you go. Hey, Lily. Today's the big day. Ready to set sail? Absolutely, Howard. I can't wait to find the last disc. Looks like Chester's ready, too. Get all your gear ready? Double check your equipment? Yep. Just need to connect the antenna and raise the anchor. Are you sure you don't want me to stay? Give you a hand. I'll be fine. Just wait for me at home with the device ready. As you command, my lady. See you soon. You got this, kiddo. Your father would be proud of you today. I know I am. Thanks, Howard. Then, now the anchor. Great. Ready to go. Sorry, but I'm gonna need this. Heavy helmet, check. Ah. 
goodbye, Chess. owned by the museum. impacts. Some hit the fuel loading area. is going to be thrilled. Guess I'll just crawl in.
The radio doesn't work. <gasps> no sign of the old man. What do we do with the girl? Leave her. We have orders to look for him. Damn it, you morons! Let's move! Lily, we need to talk, sweetheart. What's wrong? Ron, your dad, he's been on a very long journey and, well, I'm afraid he won't be coming back. Why won't he come back? He wanted to, Lily, but sometimes things happen that are beyond our control. It's like he's on a journey to a place very far away and it's not possible for him to return. I do now, Howie. You know, your dad and I, we've been more than good neighbors. We've been best friends for a very long time. And he asked me to take care of you, Lily. To be there for you just like he would be. So you're going to come live with me in my house. But what if I don't like it here? Are you kidding me? You're here all the time. Don't worry. You'll be fine. We'll go on our own adventures. And you won't be alone. I have something for you. Close your eyes. Okay, open your eyes now. For you, Lily, his name is Chester. He'll be your new companion and protector. Just like I'll be. Thank you, Howard. I'm glad I have you. Ugh. What happened? Chester, are you okay? Oh, poor thing. Oh, thank goodness you're safe. Are those guys after Howard? We need to warn him. Just a second. We need to find Howard and make sure he's aware of the danger. Howard's boat. He must be in his studio. Chester! What's wrong, boy? Something's wrong. Howard? What happened here? Howard! Apparently my room wasn't searched.
It's been an arduous journey, but I think we're close to finding the treasure's location. With the piece that Lily's bringing, we'll be able to confirm it. I suspect someone is watching us. Maybe I'm scared because I know we're so close to reaching our goal. But if anything happened to Lily, I couldn't live with it. When this is over, I'll tell her the truth. Who, who are you? All right. Where is it? What? I, I don't have anything. Don't play games with us. We know you have it. The last disc of the artifact. I don't know what you're talking about. We don't have time for this. Search the house. You are coming with us. Oh no, Howard. No doubt they're after the treasure. I need to find it before them. Maybe I can use it to trade and save him. Hang on, Howard. I'll need two things. The location of the chalice and a replacement for my helmet. Howard is always at the lighthouse. I should check it. Rodrigo Menendez Espinosa, the famous treasure hunter. No one has yet found the chalice he was carrying when his galleon sank. Fits perfectly. might do the trick down there. The alignment seems off. Hmm. Yes! 
Yes, I did it. This is where the treasure is. Wait a minute. I should mark the location on the map. Next thing I need is a diving helmet. Check my old house. Looks like the bridge has been out of use for a while. I need to find another way across. My childhood playground. It's been ages. Okay, I'm too old for the treehouse anyway. I spent hours swinging and waiting to see the ship that would bring Dad back. Finally, that was a tough one. I have. 
haven't been here in years. Pearl! Mermaids were my favorite thing when I was a kid. This house has certainly seen better days. Ron's last team. Howard said they were bad company, yet they found the second disc with them. Wait. The guy in the striped shirt is the one who attacked me on the boat. Perfect. That's the helmet I need. Looks like it's still in good condition. Who would have thought this would be the last photo we'd take together, Dad? I've got everything I need. Time to make my way back to the boat and search for the treasure. What's that noise? Come on, Chester. of hard work and searching, we finally made it to the spot where the ship sank. I'm so close to finding the chalice. I can't give up now. Must be getting closer. Finally, Howard was right after all.
Should be high enough. I better get out of here right now. those who trespass this place with a greedy heart. All right. Thanks for taking care of this for so long, Captain. It's over, Ron. The museum found the last disc. Tomorrow they'll take it on their plane. I know. Screw that. I have a plan. I'll gather my friends at the airfield and we'll prevent it from leaving. Stop right there. It's reckless. Someone could get hurt. We won't hurt anybody. We'll just force them to give it to us. It's still dangerous. Believe me. There'll be other opportunities. The opportunity is now. We waited too long. Ron, I implore you. It's madness. Think about your child. All I do is think about Lily. I do this for her. Don't you see? After selling the chalice, we'll all be rich. Damn it. Howard, I'm doing this with or without you.
better be the last time we have to deal with you. Stay put! The key? Coming. Where is Howard? What have you done to him? Let me out! Silence! treasure all this time. Imagine that. The captain won't believe his eyes when he sees it. Stairs. Keep an eye on those two. There he is. Oh, he's heavily guarded, though.
I'll handle it. That voice. Plane robbery ends in tragedy. Aircraft missing in the sea. The plan to get the disc peacefully went terribly wrong. They were watching us? Time no see, my friend. What the hell do you think you're doing, Ron? I'm doing the same as you, from what I heard. We're about to discover the treasure we've been chasing for so long. I don't know where it is. You kidnapped me before I could find it, you psychopath. You can't fool me. My men spotted your boat in the area of the plane crash. I just came from the lighthouse, the last disc. You solved it. I only asked my men to bring you here because I wanted to talk to you. Captain? The chalice? But how? A girl had it. She's in the hold. Oh no, Lily! What? You involved her in this? How could you? I didn't involve her, but it's a little late for you to be concerned about your daughter now, Ron. What did you expect me to do? After the plane incident, I had a price on my head. I couldn't expose Lily. Nothing stopped you from coming back to her. You told my daughter that I was dead. I wish you had stayed that way. Now Lily is in danger again. There she is! Get her! Hold your fire! Don't shoot!
happened? You're safe now, darling. Ron pulled you out of the water. Lily, I'm so happy to see you. I should have never let you into this mess. We underestimated the danger. Both of us. I... I don't get it. This treasure... Was it worth more than the truth? You're right. This thing brought us nothing but trouble. Take this, Lily. It's rightfully yours to decide what to do now. Lily, please forgive me. We can mend what's broken. We can use the Chalice's money to go on new expeditions and build a life together. Let me make up for lost time. I promise I won't let you down. Come with me. Ron, you risked yourself to save my life. While part of me wants to reclaim the lost time, I'm not sure if I can bring myself to forgive you for leaving me for so long. It was a mistake to hide the truth from you. I just didn't know what to do. Suddenly, I found myself alone with a little girl. I didn't think Ron was going to come back. You know I love you more than anyone else in this world. Now that it's all over, we can publish our findings and put all this behind us. What do you say? Howard, you know that I love you too. You've been like a father to me. I could always count on you, in good times or bad. But I don't know how to process the fact that you've lied to me my whole life. So this is the famous chalice. How many people have been ruined by it? Has it ever saved anyone? With it, I could do whatever I wanted. Follow my own desires. Travel. It would be a solitary journey, perhaps. I feel like my whole life was shaped by you both. It's time for me to go my own way. I owe myself that. I'll be fine. The world is one great deep ocean. And I can't wait to dive down into its waters. What happened? You're safe now, darling. Ron pulled you out of the water. Lily, I'm so happy to see you. I should have never let you into this mess. We underestimated the danger. Both of us. I... I don't get it. This treasure... Was it worth more than the truth? You're right. This thing brought us nothing but trouble. Take this, Lily. It's rightfully yours to decide what to do now. Lily, please forgive me. We can mend what's broken. We can use the Chalice's money to go on new expeditions and build a life together. Let me make up for lost time. I promise I won't let you down. Come with me. Ron, you risked yourself to save my life. While part of me wants to reclaim the lost time, I'm not sure if I can bring myself to forgive you for leaving me for so long. It was a mistake to hide the truth from you. I just didn't know what to do. 
Suddenly, I found myself alone with a little girl. I, I didn't think Ron was going to come back. You know I love you more than anyone else in this world. Now that it's all over, we can publish our findings and put all this behind us. What do you say? Howard, you know that I love you too. You've been like a father to me. I could always count on you, in good times or bad. But I don't know how to process the fact that you've lied to me my whole life. So this is the famous chalice. How many people have been ruined by it? Has it ever saved anyone? With it, I could do whatever I wanted. Follow my own desires. Travel. It would be a solitary journey, perhaps. If I look back, my choice is clear. You were always with me. And it wasn't easy. I'm sorry, Ron, but he is my real family. And we deserve the credit for what we've achieved together. Come on, Howie. Let's go home. What happened? You're safe now, darling. Ron pulled you out of the water. Lily, I'm so happy to see you. I should have never let you into this mess. We underestimated the danger. Both of us. I... I don't get it. This treasure... Was it worth more than the truth? You're right. This thing brought us nothing but trouble. Take this, Lily. It's rightfully yours to decide what to do now. Lily, please forgive me. We can mend what's broken. We can use the Chalice's money to go on new expeditions and build a life together. Let me make up for lost time. I promise I won't let you down. Come with me. Ron, you risked yourself to save my life. While part of me wants to reclaim the lost time, I'm not sure if I can bring myself to forgive you for leaving me for so long. It was a mistake to hide the truth from you. I just didn't know what to do. Suddenly, I found myself alone with a little girl. I didn't think Ron was going to come back. You know I love you more than anyone else in this world. Now that it's all over, we can publish our findings and put all this behind us. What do you say? Howard, you know that I love you too. You've been like a father to me. I could always count on you, in good times or bad. But I don't know how to process the fact that you've lied to me my whole life. So this is the famous chalice. How many people have been has it ever saved anyone? With it, I could do whatever I wanted. Follow my own desires. Travel. It would be a solitary journey, perhaps. It's not easy to forgive you, but I'll give you a chance. There's so much I don't know about you. 
And the only way to get to know you and fix something between us is to spend time together. Howard, you must understand. He's part of my life, too. Ron, I'm ready to go home. Thank you.